Hi there. My name is Michelle Reitler and I am the science teacher for IDEA. And I wanted to welcome you to using Moodle with the K through eight grades for your portfolio samples. And I wanted to give you a quick tutorial on how to uh, integrate Google Drive with your Moodle portfolio samples. So Mrs. Stimson has graciously allowed me to be a student in one of her classes. And so what we're going to do is we're going to look at grade four, but this will be the standard format for all of the Moodle classes for the K through eight teachers. The first tab is the links to idea resources, which if you click on it to open it, opens up a program called Symbaloo. And Symbaloo is a very quick, easy resource because what it does is it allows you to very quickly click on different icons and it takes you right to those programs. So it's kind of like a favorites, but visual in format. The second one is the one that we're most interested in. And so here we have her portfolio sample uploads and we're gonna look at math. So you just click on the icon of the one you're interested in and there are um, portfolio suggestions. You can take a look right here. And you can see it's done by grade level. You can then add that to your drive if you'd like to by just clicking on the add to drive folder uh, icon and that will add it to your my drive section. Um, that will allow you to very quickly access this material without having to go through Moodle to find it again. But we're going to go back. So when we click on the portfolio samples for December to January, you'll see that there's three portfolio samples required. And so we're going to click on portfolio one. And then it looks different for me because it still has me as a teacher. But um, you would click the add submission link. But let me show you how to do that. So when you click the add submission link, um, it's going to give you the option of giving an online uh, text or it will also give you uh, an option for submitting a file. So the way you do that, I'm going to quickly click over to my, um, my email address and this is my email, this is my personal email and I'm doing that so that my drive is a little less complicated, but um, to get to your drive, from here, you just click on the apps button, which is these nine little white squares next to your name. So you click on that and then choose drive. And that brings up my drive. So let's say for math, I'm going to submit cute corgi pictures. Probably not going to actually submit that, but you know, hey, it is what it is. So um, I want to see my cute corgi pictures. So I just click switch to grid and you can see that I've got quite a few of them in here. But um, let's say for my submission, I want to give Mrs. Stimson the ABS corgis. So what you do is you click on it. And since in this case it's a picture, I'm going to click open. It will also do that if it's a, a PDF document. And so what I do is I click on the URL right here, right click on it and say copy. And then I go back to my Google Drive or, or my Moodle, sorry, and I click that add submission. And I'm going to click on, where's mine? It doesn't have me in there, but I could click on the submission here and it gives you an online text comment and you can paste the URL. OK, it says it's not supported by, by my browser. So if that does it to you, then you hold the control key down and push the V as in Victor button, and that will paste your URL. And so instead of saying feedback comments, it'll say like online text. And then you just paste that URL and you're done and you say submit. And I'm going to cancel out of this so I don't get into somebody else's stuff because that's not cool. So that's a very brief introduction of how you do that for your integrating Google Documents with, uh, with Moodle. If you have any questions, by all means, please contact your contact teacher or make sure that you have had a conversation with either me or the Moodle manager, Ms. Evanowski. But typically, um, I'm going to be easily reachable by email as will your contact teachers. And we're all here to be happy to help you with integrating Moodle and Google Docs. Thanks very much, and I hope you have a great day.